What's up everybody? It's Kelsey Brianna J here with a video on all of the new highlighters that have released like in the past two weeks. Literally is highlighter mania. These are the most amount of highlighters that I've ever seen be released at one time. And you guys, at the rate we're going, it's not going to stop. In lieu of that, I decided to make a video where it's like a compilation of me talking about all of the highlighters that have recently come out on the market. Not only will I be talking about the highlighters, but I also will be trying them on my face. So that way you guys can see what they look like on my skin. It's gonna be a demo so you guys can know which ones to buy, which wants to skip and it's like do I need all these highlighters the answer is yes you do like just to save you some time you do but I, I just wanted to overview it for you guys anybody who's like literally feeling overwhelmed I'm kind of feeling a little overwhelmed in the makeup department I feel like it's something that comes out every five not every it used to feel like something was coming out new every day now I feel like something new is coming out every single hour so the highlighters that I'll be trying on and giving you guys an overview of in this video are the Milani Spotlight Highlighters and I have the new NARS Bonk Disable Highlighter Trio. I have the Cover Effects Halo Holographic Drops. I have the Too Faced Ray of Light Love Light Highlighter. I have the Tom Ford Sheer Highlighting Duo in Reflex Guilt. And I have two more products that I want to mention that I already have full videos dedicated on, but it definitely came out within this mania. And if I had known I was going to buy so many other highlighters, I probably would have combined the videos. You guys probably can guess that one of them is the Estee Lauder highlighter in the color Heat Wave. I will have this video linked somewhere here as well as down below. Make sure you check that video out if you want a detailed review and demo and comparisons and all that good stuff. And same with the Nicole Guerrero Glow Kit. I gave this Glow Kit its own video. And in the video, I review it, give comparisons, and demo it, and all that good stuff. So if you want to see that, I will have a link to that video here, as well as in the description box. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and jump into the video. There are so many highlighters in so little time. The first highlighter that I'm going to try out is the Too Faced Love Light Prismatic Highlighter. I have the color Ray of Light. I love this packaging. I think it's super cute. It's shaped in a heart and it looks like chrome. It says Too Faced and it has the information of it on the back. It has 9.0 grams of product. So then we open it up and it comes with a little mirror and then look at the design. Look how pretty this is. Using unique Prisma Shine technology, Love Light takes the best of powder, liquid, baked, and cream formulas to create unparalleled color payoff for a pearl radiance you've never seen. Universal shades are suitable for most skin tones and last four hours. Like four hours, like not four hours, but like four hours. I think they could have like said that differently. <laughs> oh, I have my Anastasia A23 brush. Mm-hmm. It's like a more natural highlighter. It's definitely building up. It's like a natural lit from within type glow. I mean, do a swatch for you guys. I really love this design. I think it's super cute. And the powder is really, really soft. Like, really, really soft. You see, it's like just super, super natural looking. These are the Cover FX Drops. These are the Custom Enhancer Drops and I did a review on these when they first released this summer. They've since come out with more colors and I have the color Halo. So here we have Halo. These are described as holographic drops. Comes in this dropper. And you guys can see it's multi-dimensional. And you can see like how fluid it is. And how like intense that is this retails for $42 and it has 15 milliliters or 0.5 fluid ounces of product what I'm gonna do is squeeze a little bit of that and put some on the back of my hand like so I guess I could have just used the squeeze that I just used but I didn't and I'm going to dip the brush in the product and ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna lightly buff that. 
Oh wow. Okay, so I do not like that with this brush. Oh my god, I put so much with my finger. I have a beauty blender here too. Oh, this is making a mess. This is like seriously a mess. Let me turn off my light so you guys can see. It's too cool toned. So now, I'm moving on. I'm gonna clean this off and then we're gonna try some more. So now I have some Milani highlighters. These are the Spotlight highlighter. This one is number one, number two, and number three. Number one is called Sunlight. It is the lightest. And then we have number two, Candlelight. Then we have number three, Golden Light, which is a bronzy gold. I'm gonna start off with number three. I'm just gonna swirl my brush all in this. Let's apply it and see what, oh wow. Okay, so this is really pigmented. On me, it's too dark for a highlighter, but it definitely could be a blush for me or a blush topper. But highlight, absolutely out of the question. And then this one is number two. So again, I'm swirling it. I'm using the Anastasia A23 brush again. And I like this one, because it's like a traditional highlighter. And it has like a nice gold tone to it, but it's also still like kind of pinkish toned. And then lastly, we have Zero One, which I think this one is the one that I would gravitate towards the most. Very pretty. Nice, finely milled highlighter. This one is like the more golden tone one. I picked these up from Walgreens. They were $9.99 when I got them. These have 0.18 ounces or five grams of products. They also say that you can use this as a face or an eye palette. So multitasking palette with universal flattering shades to illuminate face and eyes. Light reflecting powders build and blend effortlessly for an instant glow. Next, I have the NARS Blanc de Sable Highlighter Palette. And I picked this up from Sephora. And the net weight of this palette is 0.11 ounces or 3.4 grams of product times three. Oh my God, does this not just look like a beautiful bar of gold? We have three different highlighters. I don't even think the camera can pick it up. So it goes from lightest to darkest. These three highlighters are all pretty fair. It's embossed in there. Like how cute. I'm going to try these lightest to darkest. Okay. Very reflective. Oh, it looks wet on the cheeks. There's basically no kickback from this powder. Huh. It's really pretty. It's like a nice natural highlight. So I'm gonna go into this very last one now. This is so finely milled. Like basically the design hasn't even gotten messed up. Like it's still there. Oh my God, this palette is absolutely gorgeous. I love this one. I love highlighters like this. Like just super sophisticated and just like nice. It's like a classy highlighter palette. This is limited edition. On Sephora's app, it does say that this product is exclusive and it retails for $49. And last up, my favorite. I have a new time for a highlighter. This one is a sheer highlighting duo. Look at this packaging. Like how Lux is time for with this gold foil packaging, okay? So, White packaging, trimmed in gold. Ooh, so print time. I hate to mess up my design, but <laughs> it's happening. So I'm going to start with the top, like I can't wait. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God, I need another one of these. I can't. I am done. I love this, love this. I knew I had to have it. When I saw it, I was like, I have to have it. Y'all know that commercial. Okay, so I'm gonna do the bottom. Yep, it did, it did it. That's it, thanks Tom Ford, you did it again. Oops, I did it again. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. Like I've never 
not impressed with Tom Ford's formula. It makes your skin look delicious. So freaking pretty. I got this from Sephora. They're releasing the Tom Ford Summer Stuff slowly but surely. This retails for $78. Yes, it is expensive because Tom Ford is a high-end brand. 0.1 ounce or 3 grams of product. This is described as a highlighting duo for the cheeks, eyes, and face to achieve glowing skin. Phew! So many highlighters. <laughs> Let me know what your favorites were down in the comment section. Tell me which ones you're going to be picking up. Tell me which ones you already own. And if you like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. That way I will keep content like this coming to you guys. And if you like me and you want to see more videos from me, make sure you subscribe. Show me that you support. And I will talk to you guys in my very next video. Smooches. Bye.